What is up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. you came around. Came around. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. The only reason this is a new place in town. I've never been here before, so I thought it'd be really fun to take you guys with. Lately I've been wondering just what is love? What is love? what is up you guys welcome back to the channel thank you so much for clicking on today's video if you are new here and this is your first time seeing me hello my name is kayla so very nice to meet you and i couldn't be more excited for today's video as you can tell by the title we are doing a q a mukbang and it's been a while it's been a freaking minute and these are some of my favorite videos to film because it's just a way that we can like hang out chill talk eat some food and just I don't know kick it this is a new place in town I've never been here before so I thought it'd be really fun to take you guys with I love the vibes I love the aesthetics you'll see what I'm talking about I'll get some cool b-roll for you guys and then we'll come back to the car and I will answer you guys' questions so I hope you guys are excited if you are give this video a big thumbs up and if you're new to my channel and you like the vibes, you like me, consider subscribing. I would love for you to join the fam. And let's go get some tacos. All this time, I've been feeling hopeless till you came around, came around. All this time, you're the only reason I'm not chasing highs, chasing highs. What is love? Lately I've been wondering just what is love, what is love I don't know, no one ever showed me I've been on my own for too long You guys have bottle openers? I for do. the yeah. yeah, I'll take a Coke Okay, a bottle of Coke? Yeah, yeah. And it's up for here to go? Uh, to go It's 34 Did I leave my wallet in the car? So I forgot my freaking wallet, but that's okay because you don't have to pay right away. Um, you can pay at the end and stuff like that. Um, and she asked if I wanted it for here to go, and I said to go. That way I can eat in my car. They do have a cute seating area over there. I am going to try and um, film a little bit of that as well. I just don't want them to think that I'm like, you know being weird because it can look a little sketchy um when you're just so okay with vlogging in public people are like okay what is she filming and i actually did leave my wallet this time i didn't you know have it on me the whole time if you guys saw the vlog where i went back to my car i was like oh i need to go get my wallet i'm like no it was in my pocket the entire time yeah i'll link that up in the sky Whoa, there's a line now. There's a lot of people. So yeah, I don't want people to like stare at me. They always do, you guys. I just don't care. I don't, I don't know, so. Let me just say this smells freaking bomb. It smells fresh. It just It's smelling good before we get started eating and answering some questions I want to give like a little tiny review on what I think of the place. Um, you guys I love it I think it's so cute. I love their color scheme. I love the style. I love the setup I love the modern vibes. I love the location. It's really clean. I love the outdoor seating. The girls were super nice, and I thought the prices were great, too. Based off of first impression, I have high hopes for these tacos. Got some green sauce. I'm hoping that slaps. Like, I feel like you can't go wrong with tacos. It's just, it's really hard to do tacos wrong, so I'm optimistic. I also got a bottled Coke doing it real big, ladies and gents. I would have loved, like, a Coke Zero, but... But I don't think they had that. So we went with regular Coke. Let's give a taste test. It's a little sweeter. Not like extremely sweet. Definitely different than a Coke Zero though. That's for sure. There's just nothing like a Coke Zero. I'm sorry. And it's guilt free, you know. But anyways, I am so excited to dig in. Got a little napkin, that's good. 
got the green sauce. I feel like that can really make or break the tacos. So, again, optimistic, okay? Okay, I'm excited to see what they look like. I'm ready to dig in. Just took my thumbnail, but you guys, these look so bomb. They smell delicious. You already know I'm digging into the lime, okay? Oh, you guys see that? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That lime is juicy. That's a juicy lime right there. My only complaint so far, I would have loved more than one napkin. You know what I'm saying? I can't believe I really got to move out of this bitch. My camera will literally explode. Oopsie belt. Ooh, ooh, oh, jeez. My tacos better not. Ooh, my tacos fall. I cannot believe we have to jump ship. We have to move. Of course, right when I move, the sun gets covered up by clouds. That's hilarious. Love to see it. Really? Well, where are we going to park? Because I need to eat, okay? I'm hungry. At a red light, perfect time to turn you guys off. And I will meet up with you guys when I find a good parking spot. Okay, so, new location. We are currently in my gym parking lot. Well, technically Red Robin. I'm more on the Red Robin side. But... They share the same parking lot. The tacos are set. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Comment down below. Let me know. Are you guys eating with me? Am I eating alone? What's the deal? Let me know. And if you are eating with me, what are you eating? I would love to know because sometimes it's really hit or miss with me. Like sometimes I do eat when I watch mukbangs and sometimes I don't. I don't watch them all the time. The only mukbang people I really watch is Chelsea Lynn and her friend Libby Higgins. Um, Higgins? Hins? I, I don't know how to pronounce her last name. I also don't watch mukbangs on a regular basis. I know a lot of people are into those. Now, I do love when my favorite people do them. I love watching them. Whatever. It doesn't freaking matter. Mm -hmm. This is growing on me. I will say that. Now, I was just going to dive right into eating, but I feel like I should answer a question first, and then we can get eating. So, let's see. I took a screenshot of your guys' questions. Alrighty, so first question, and I'm so sorry, I don't know how to pronounce your name. I will put it here on the screen, but it says, hi Kayla, my question is, what are three goals you would like to accomplish by the end of the year? Thanks for all your hard work, sending you lots of love. Thank you so much for leaving your question. Super sweet, super kind, and hmm, three goals by the end of the year. I have a lot, and they're all social media, YouTube, related and these are in no particular order but I want to start making TikToks to find a place up in Bellingham third one would be and it's probably like my biggest dream and that would be to do YouTube full-time but again I don't really expect that by the end of the year and then I have other things that I want to do like create vlogmas merch so yeah those are a few of my goals okay I'm ready to dig in my mouth is freaking salivating um, gosh, I hope this video isn't a bust. I don't like having to change locations and the lighting looking different and all that. It's really annoying that I had to do that, but I just didn't want my camera to blow the fuck up. Okay, um, yeah, so I'm super excited. I'm so ready to dig in. And we're gonna try a taco, all right? Mmm. Mmm. Stop. Stop. Holy shit, you guys. I didn't even put sauce on it. I don't know what it is about these tacos, but these are bomb. I'm sorry, but blows La Bamba out of the water. And you guys, La Bamba is my spot. That is the only place I get tacos. And they just like slapped the shit out of them is what they did. Disrespectful, but like in the best way. Holy crap, fire. I can only imagine what their green sauce tastes like after tasting their taco. Again, I wish I had more napkins. That's like my only complaint, but okay. I don't know if this is spicy. I don't think it is, but we're just gonna have a dollop, okay? The bar is high for this green sauce, I'm not gonna lie, because their their tacos, again, slap the shit out of me. They are so good. Mm. 
you got they like melt in your mouth i don't even know how to explain it i don't even know how to explain it holy shit you guys my pinky has been up the entire time like this has been still up damn holy shit you guys i know i'm only one taco down but i'm claiming it and saying it right now these are the best tacos i have ever had in my entire life i am not exaggerating i honestly feel sorry for you if you don't have one of these by you i feel so sorry for you i i i that sucks that 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 really sucks because again hmm. I'm at a loss for words. I truly am. So we're going to get into the next question. Um, this question is from Sabrina Wallen. Hey, Kayla, again, I will tell you, you are definitely my favorite YouTuber. Your videos are amazing and bring me so much comfort. I suffer from depression, anxiety really bad, and watching you helps me so much with that. I don't have a question. I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart for sharing your life with us. Love you, mean it. LOL. Okay, seriously, the sweetest thing ever. The fact that my videos comfort you is like music to my ears. I don't think you realize how much that means to me. It truly, wow. Like, I, I don't even know what to say. I'm speechless. So again, thank you so much for your kind words. They truly mean the freaking world to me. Alrighty, so next question from Emily97. Kate, how long have you been married? I've already answered this question, but I have no problem answering it again. I've been married for three and a half years, going on four. We've been together for like seven or eight. I always get it mixed up. I'm not quite sure, but we've been together for a long time. Okay, I need to dig into another freaking taco. Okay. Okay, I'm sorry, but these tacos are fire i have to take derek here he is going to shit his pants okay i'm so excited to dig in mm. Mm. has a little heat mm. Mm. you guys these are fire i wish you guys were eating what i was eating I wish you guys were eating what I was eating. Mmm. Oh my god. Woo! Yep, sauce is hot. Sauce is hot, but it's good. Mmm. Mmm. You guys, the flavor. Mmm. Okay, I totally just dug into another taco, and Miss Emily had another question. How did you and your husband meet? So I'm assuming you're new because I've answered that as well. Me and Derek went to high school together. We kind of knew each other, but not really. And yeah, that's where we met. Okay, usually these videos are super easy to film and they go off without a hitch, but not today. No. Oh no. It's just been a mission. I've had to change locations. I just got out of Target because I had to charge you guys. So I took a brief intermission. And you guys, I was thinking about this taco the entire time I was in there. I didn't bring my wallet in on purpose. I am ready to hurry up and eat. Ooh, that's a lot. This is hot. This is spicy. Get into that. You see that shit right there? Oh my gosh. Mmm. I cannot wait to come back. Mmm. And you can eat there, call in your orders, and take it to go. It's like the best of both worlds. Mmm. Wow. I should have got more. Mm. I don't like anything like that. Mm mm. That was bomb. Calm down, sir. 
next question and again i do not know how to pronounce your name i am so sorry but you asked how do you and derek manage your finances do you guys fight and do you like your job sorry if it's personal not personal at all i love these kinds of questions i love talking about money i didn't used to but i do now um so do we fight no not really we don't if we argue there's something going on i mean of course we bicker like any other couple and to be honest with you if there is any bickering going on it's usually me and it's more than likely got to do with the house and keeping it clean that's just me you guys i like a clean home besides that we don't really argue about anything you also asked how do you and derek manage your finances i feel like ours is very different than most we have a joint checking account a joint savings account Account, and then we have another savings account in a completely different bank and then we also have some stocks now I have no idea how to do stocks that's all him he does all that he knows what he's doing paying the bills I do all of that we also only have one debit card and I keep it um, Derek never buys anything like ever if he needs anything I buy it um and it wasn't always that way he used to have a debit card but something happened to where he lost his wallet or i can't remember exactly what it was but we were supposed to get him a new debit card oh i remember chipotle systems got hacked when we ate there once so we changed debit cards we got one and then we we're like oh yeah we'll go back in and get you one well we never did and your last question was do you like your job and the answer to that is i actually do i love interacting with people i love cashiering i love customer service Service. I love doing the ordering and the margins and being able to wear what I want. I love my schedule and the hours that I worked. It really is a perfect fit. And to be honest with you, this job is the only reason why I started YouTube. All the jobs that I've had in the past would not allow me to also do YouTube, especially now that I know how much work goes into it. There's no way. So I truly am grateful for this job. Next question is, how do you feel about your parents moving and would would you and Derek consider moving too? So I'll answer the second question first. And yes, Derek and I definitely are consider moving. We definitely want to move up to Bellingham. It's where my parents currently live now. But unfortunately, my parents are moving and I'm I'm really bummed about it, you guys. I'm really sad that my mom isn't going to be in the same state as me. I honestly don't know what I'm going to do when that day comes. It's going to be very quick. I believe they're moving middle, end of July. So it is creeping up and I just would rather not think about it. And I really am happy for them. It's just going to take some getting used to, that's all. So that is it, you guys. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm so sorry I didn't get to all your questions but I really would hate for my battery to just die mid-sentence. I do not want that to happen, but that just means I get to film another one. Again, sorry if I didn't get to your questions. I will definitely be getting to the rest of them in the next video. So if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely give it a big thumbs up. If you are new to my channel and you made it this far, consider subscribing before you leave. I would love for you to join the fam, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Did you guys hear that? Is there really a plane going over right now? I have cotton mouth like a mother. What is up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clean Thank you so much for cleaning today's video. I did not think I was going to have to deal with the sun. It's been raining all damn day. Like what the hell? What is it? Is it is it not bright enough? Is that too bright? Every time. I still hear you. <laughs> Whoa. Ah, sis, you don't even know your own intro? Like, I just felt like my forehead was like really dark. Thank God I had this water bottle in my car because I'm pretty sure you can hear the cotton mouth when I speak. Uh. Oh yeah, definitely gonna be burping in this video. I think that's too dark. I need to like brighten it up a little because when I hold this up, it gets darker. Or does it get lighter? Does it get darker? Yeah, it gets darker, see? And then it gets lighter when I move it down. What is going on? By the way, I'm sorry we had to... Ch the motorcycle, sir. What's so funny is because in my head I was talking shit. I was like, they only give me one green sauce. You only need one green sauce, bitch. Okay, it's freaking hot. It's spicy. Cool your jets. It's usually... I have a bubble in my throat. What the hell? It's usually me. <clears throat> All this time, I've been feeling hopeless till you came around, came around. All this time, you're the only reason I'm not chasing highs, 
chasing highs What is love? Lately I've been wondering just what is love 